Switching gears now, we'll jump to some baseball. The first place Orioles back home after another winning road trip. Yeah, sports director Mark Viviana, he joins us from Camden Yards, where uh, some O's players uh, have made, I, I don't know, is it I a fashion know where, statement? I know where is it a costume? <laughs> you don't tell us about what they're wearing, Mark. Put it this way, playing winning baseball is the statement the Orioles want to make, and being in first place is always fashionable. We know that, but we've also learned about this year's Orioles team. They're capable of taking things to another level. So they are back home after winning three out of four games in Toronto. The Birds get set to take on the visiting New York Mets, and a group of Oriole players agreed to make a grand entrance this afternoon. Colton Kowser, Ryan Mountcastle, Adley Rutschman, and Gunnar Henderson decked out in jumpsuits and futuristic shades. The arrival has gone viral with rave reviews along with theories of what was the intended statement. It's on brand for a team that's young and having fun, and I went in search of their motivation. Pretty funny looking, but uh, yeah, we're just, I don't know, we went on Amazon and just did some shopping and uh, found some jumpsuits and sunglasses that we thought would look funny, so uh, yeah, I think we, we pulled it off pretty decent. We had the glasses and we were like, well, what could we wear with them, and uh, that, that was something that we thought of. When you say we, there are many who believe it was Colton Cowser's idea to take it to um, this extent. Was it? Um, I'd say you say it was a group because I'd say it's a more of a group effort, a little bit. Um, but yeah, you, I, I brought it up. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'd say that. Is that exactly what you were looking for? Uh, yeah, we uh, when we showed up to the parking lot, it was pretty funny being able to look at each other in our outfits. As, as I say, it's a pretty good success. Now, th this shows a side of your personality maybe more than others because you're kind of considered the softer spoken guy. But as we get to see, you're in for the good times when they're available, right? Yeah, and uh, so I'll take it back to high school not too many years ago, but like uh, during like our homecoming dress-up days, I went all out for it, so this was right up my alley. These are your teammates arriving at the ballpark. Your thoughts? I, I still don't know what they were going for. Uh, I saw some Cheetah Girls takes. I saw some Teletubby takes. Um, the Power Rangers one. That was the one I thought was uh, the best, um, the Power Rangers look. But I think Mountie uh, picked the best color. I think that's something that he could probably wear uh, even if they weren't all walking together. Yeah, Power Rangers would be appropriate given the amount of home run power in that group. And you know what? The fashion show doesn't end because it's a Friday night home game, which means the Orioles will be wearing those City Connect all black uniforms, which the fans really don't like that much. But like we said before, if they win, nobody complains. We'll have more on the O's and uh, their series with the Mets coming up next hour. Back to my fashionable friends back at the studio. Very diplomatic, Mark. Very diplomatic.